Today, we are creating this 3D wooden logo for Royal Mart Furnitures. So we're going to be using a wooden background for this 3D one, but we could also use the black background 2D and it would look like this. This is the other version of the 3D. So join me. So just before we jump into Canva, I just wanted to say a big shout out to Royal Mart Furnitures. We're giving them the ideas. They're going to run with it and see what they do with the logo ideas we are creating for them today. So what you would do, you would create a blank logo canvas on Canva, rename it, call it RM Furnitures, and then start designing. So today's tutorial, we're going to create from scratch. That's why we need a blank canvas. We're not going to be using a template. Uh, I thought because I didn't do a consultation and this is just us giving Royal Mart Furniture's ideas and logos. So I thought we could start by adding text. You just press T on your keyboard and you start adding your text. So we are going to use the League Spartan font and then we're going to use the R and we're going to duplicate that so that we also have an M. Add more text so that we can have the bottom part of their name, of, of their brand. And you align it and size it so that it's in sync. You highlight everything, you group it, and you size it, add it to the center. That way you can also make it a bit big if you want so that it talks to what you want to design next you're going we're going to add a crown because they are royal mud furnitures so i found this crown so what you would do you would go to elements and search for crown and find whichever one you want to go with so this particular one i liked because it was not a image it was a graphic that we could tweak and change color as you can see when you have it highlighted you are able to change the colors so i'm going to change everything to black and the last one i'm going to make that gold and last thing i'm gonna go to shapes um and i'm gonna click on see all then I'm looking for this shape that could cover our logo nicely like that and I'll change the color of that to gold. So I'm going to make everything gold. And we could have a black background and our 2D is done. So all you do, you click on download, download it as a transparent, and then your 2D is ready to be transformed to a 3D. Next, we're going to add a page here so that we can do the second uh, design so that we give him ideas most. So with the second one, I thought we could look for a couch. So all you do, you go to your elements and you search for a couch and then you scroll until you find the couch that you would like to use so the one that i found that i want us to use is this one here size it like that and then you add text so purple maybe is not your color you could just highlight the image and go to edit image and use the duo tone to change the background of the couch to whatever color you want. So maybe we could go with gold and then it would change it and make it nice gold and you click on apply and then your second option looks like this. The last logo would be and you would go to your elements and search for furniture 
and then you could look through the furniture until you find and you click on graphics and you look on through the furniture until you find the one you like i liked this one and um, it is black so i'm going to change that color and make it gold and then i would put it on the left hand side of the logo then i would press l for line because then i would i want to add a line between the name of the company as well as the furniture i'll change the color of my line to gold as well i don't know which color you want to go with man you are welcome to change it this is just us giving you an a couple of ideas last thing that you would do is to add text so i'm gonna add text and i'm gonna fast forward And there you go your third 2d is done and you can just click on transparent and download page by page depending on whichever one you want to take it to photo p to convert it to a 3d cool now we are going to photo p once you open photo p um because the the templates that are here there is no wooden one we're going to use the folder that i've shared with you you could find this 3d wall logo mock-up that's got a, a wooden background you just open it from your computer and you load it once it's loaded you go on your right hand side you double click where it says your logo and you hide the text don't worry about the blue and then click and drag the logo that you would like to convert and center then you're going to click on uh, file save a smart object once it's saved a smart object you click on 3d wall logo mockup once and you wait and voila your 3d gorgeous looking logo is done transformed you then go to file export as png there are other options depending on what and who you want to share this logo with you would click on png and then you would adjust your width so that it doesn't pixelate so much and then you click on save and that is the first one so let's quickly do the normal one that we do and your 3d is converted so you could click on the backlight light so that it takes away that darkness and then you just go do exactly the same thing file export as png and then change the width and then x save Thank you for um, watching the video. Thank you for spending time with me. You can watch the next video where we do a fun care logo. Go watch that one. And be prepared and be ready to um, get your online course. I'm busy creating a Canva online course that is also going to include a little bit of social media marketing because some of you asked for that. But thank you. I will see you next time.